Welcome to the channel. Today, we're gonna to be testing out this comfy mini dishwasher. So let's see how fine and good it is. So let's firstly open it up. Right, this I bought from Amazon and I paid just under 300 pounds for it. I'll put the information at the bottom if need be of what it actually did cost. Okay, so the first is going to be all the information regarding the dishwasher. Okay, uh, so I'll look at the next one. There you go, there's a dishwasher there. I'm trying to find the best way to get this out. Okay, I'm just some sort of rubber seal or some kind. I'll find out what that's later on as well. There you have it, so I'll just check the back quickly. That may that may go with the back here. I'll find out. Okay. So let's start from the back first. Great, so it's a UK plug, which is great. At the back of it, you've got a connection here if you wanted to have it plumbed in. Unfortunately, I haven't got the space to do it, so this works out really well for me. And this one here is where you, you drain out all the water. And at the top, you've got like a sticker here. your water in it, I think it's six litres of water, um, but I'll have to double check the instruction manual, and uh, that's, we'll save you for plumbing in anyhow, so that's where the water goes in. And looking at it here, it will just fit just underneath that section there, and it'll save me from washing dishes. Okay. I do like the look of it, got a really nice appearance of it. Everything is touched, got touch buttons on there. So let's open it up and let's get all the protection out of here. Okay. Right, so here we go. Let's get rid of this phone. Okay, so this pipe over here is going to go at the back and I'll install that shortly. And that is for the wastage and this over here will connect to your sink over there so you, you don't have this pipe with the wastage going all over the place. And here over here is going to be if you do want it plumbed in, which I'm not going to do. Okay, so I don't need to do that. Okay, and this is for uh, going to be for your cutlery 
in there, like your, your, your knives and spoons and whatever on there. Okay. This over here is for pouring. At the back, you're gonna, and that is also for pouring as well. So what you would do is you would do that and you will put your water in there. I presume it's six liters. Okay, and it starts leaping when it's all ready. This as well. Well, put this way, it's been really packed up really nicely. So there's no actual damage to the inside of the appliance or any of the, the plastic accessories. And this, you could put your cups on there. And I've seen people put knives and forks on there as well. Side of it, and when the tray comes out, it rolls out as well, so it's rolling out of like that, which is great. Okay. Okay. Right. And this is where you put the actual salt, and when the machine is on, the dishwasher's on, this will rotate and you could do various programs on that there. I think presumably various speeds. And that, these little areas here are where all the water will come through, or the steam, because it has a steam option as well. So, we'll look through. so the, what we got on here is you've got your, your power button, your hygiene button, which is 72 degrees, your intensive, your eco, which is the longest uh, program, but it uses a less amount of energy, and your glass one, uh, your 58 minute wash and then you got rapid which it takes about 29 minutes and then your delay starts. Right, so let's get it installed at the back there so let's get let's turn it around. Right so we aren't going to plumb this in so this is where this uh, connection comes in. So you've got that cable there well, sorry, a bit of water in it. it is it is tested it is tested uh, prior to leaving the factory so um, it's quite normal to find water container so this is the end bit let's clip that out okay so I'm gonna put this pipe on there I'll put this stuff right at the front okay that's that bit done okay so let's look inside of it so look a good look inside there okay so this will rotate around uh, with steam or hot water and this over here, okay, it's going to be your little, is your little filter there, okay, so you clean that out occasionally or whenever you need to, if it gets really, really mucky, okay, and over here is where you put your salt, okay, I, I think it's two liters of, um, oh, so it's one liter of um, water and the rest you use salt, so I'll show you what you probably need. Okay, so that's all being done now. So let's put the lid back on there. Let's put this tray back in. Okay, so let's load 
it up. Any kind of uh, uh, excess food, please put it in the dustbin first. Otherwise, you end up having to clean your um, So if this goes, it slots in there. It's unusual. Oh yeah, so that's... That is pretty heavy. Heavily soiled. Much as I can fill in there, as far as I can see. So I don't know if we're going too, too much now, so I'm going to pop it in now. Okay, so we should hopefully get a bleep soon. You can feel, feel it going down, can you hear it going down? probably need about three of these three, three of these jugs because these are almost two liters each It's not bleeping yet. There you go. It's now bleeping. There you go. Right, so as you see, I did a really good job. There was no mess anywhere. Okay. Right. If I could do it, anyone could do it. Right. So 
So what I'll do, I can either leave it out there or I can just pop it back. Okay, so uh, realistically, I think we just need a rapid one on this one. Or do you want to try the other option? Mm. Uh, try a bit longer because it doesn't clean properly. Okay, so what I'm going to do, we'll go for the 58 minute. Okay, there's a 58, okay. Uh, so that, it says, should the door have opened the last one, but I don't know. Uh, I've seen other reviews on it, but they don't discuss that, and I've just basically looked at the instructions. Okay. So that's a 58 minute, that's gonna dry everything goes there. And what I do wanna see is those lids on there, they're a, they're a pain to clean uh, for my cups. Okay, so I'll leave that to it, and um, Mrs. got to do some cooking. I'll come back and check the dishes after that. Okay, bye-bye. So very, very impressed with it. It's a very, very good uh, mini dishwasher and it works perfectly with the kitchen. Uh, the missus will be washing less dishes now. Okay, so she'll have more time to do her nails or something. Uh, it's reasonably quiet. Now, 58 decibels, it's okay. So it's not too bad. It's about the same as uh, what a washing machine is. And uh, the longest wash is 235. And I think that's the intensive one or the uh, hygiene one. And you could place three play sets in there. So we're a family of four. So what we can do uh, is pretty much that. That will, that will cover it. And we just we'll have all these backup plates that we can use. And the, the, the energy rating is a grade F. Um, I'm not sure why that is on that there, but um, on the long run you're going to save money. You're not using your gas, you're not using your water, you're not using a much water, you're only using six litres of water here, and it looks great in the kitchen. So I hope you enjoy that. Uh, please like and subscribe, and if you want to support my channel, uh, you can support me by buying me a coffee or my Patreon page. Until next time, take care and bye.